Oscar-winning songwriter Lady Gaga showcased her strong core and balance by performing a headstand in the gym on Monday for the viewing pleasure of her loyal legion of little monsters. The 35-year-old pop diva, who boasts 218.7m social media followers, captioned her Instagram post, rolling into Monday like. In the past, Gaga, born Stefani Germanotta, has reportedly relied on the fitness expertise of celebrity trainer Harley Pasternak and Pilates instructor Lisa Marie Goodwin. The 12-time Grammy winner announced Monday that she was returning to Las Vegas for nine more dates of her jazz and piano residency at Park MGM Theater Dolby Live spanning April 14 to May 1. It's the seventh leg of Gaga's jazz and piano concerts, which began in January 2019, featuring four costume changes and classic songs from the Great American Songbook. Little Monsters can receive a special code at GagaVegas.com for the pre-sale this Tuesday at 10 a.m. PST, and general public tickets go on sale this Friday at 10 a.m. PST via Ticketmaster. The night and day singer has received a lot of awards season attention for her questionably accented role as convicted murderer Patrizia Reggiani in Ridley Scott's drama House of Gucci. Gaga is up for two trophies, including outstanding performance by a female actor in a leading role, at the 28th Screen Actors Guild Awards, which air February 27th on TNT slash DBS. Mother Monster is also nominated for Best Actress at the 27th Critics' Choice Awards, which air March 13th on The CW slash DBS. I don't think that Patrizia's blessing would have been meaningful to me. Because she did this reprehensible thing, Gaga scoffed in her Deadline cover story last Wednesday. And all the research that I did of her, I watched a lot of video footage of her and all of the footage of her after his death, and she is very clearly willing to speak of him as excessive and outrageous. Later in her life, after prison, she has this grandiose way of building herself up as this charismatic woman with lots of bravado, this powerhouse who had Maurizio Gucci murdered. She seems to me to possess this quality where she really wanted to drive the narrative of this famous story. And all of that to me was a total lie, and a total cover-up for the pain that I knew was inside of her. And I've studied this very closely to get it right. The NYU Tisch Dropout and Tony Bennett are also nominated for six trophies, including Album of the Year for Love for Sale, at the 64th Annual Grammy Awards, which air April 3rd on CBS. The 95-year-old legendary jazz crooner, born Anthony Benedetto, has been battling Alzheimer's disease for the last six years. 